thought I'd come out here and make a video of this Kernza field. It's the first time I've been out here. Last time I was here was uh, last, it was this spring. This is the Kernza head right here. It's uh, June 23rd. Deer flies out here. Um, I can't tell how strong the stand is. This was that. Um, that weed that was out here, I forget the name of it, um, Pennycress. The Kernza, you know, it's here. Apparently, I'm going to have to swath this. They told me it's going to be another month or so before I swath it. But it looks impressive. About 10 deer flies around me. Pretty bad out here. It's a new truck. Um, but it looks good. I guess I got to get the combine ready and check it out, take it up to deer and have them look at some error codes and get the swather ready and figure out my grain drying situation with that Kernza. I gotta get some, uh... it's nice to see There's a little bit of wind out here today. I don't know if it's going to affect the sound quality of the video, but it's cool to see the wind, how it plays with the Kernza. I might drive down and show a little bit more, get a better vantage point of this. Shoot this part from the, the road. I don't want to get out, but there's the other corner of this field, this 24 acres. And that brown stuff is that uh, pennycrest weed drying up. I don't know, it seems to be growing well. But uh, we'll see. Deer flies inside the truck. Well, you probably wouldn't want to be outside long. I really have no way to assess to figure out is this a good stand? Is this a good? But there, there's not a whole lot of weeds out there. I mean, the pigs' quarter, the pigs, the pigweed and lambs' quarter. I, th I was worried about them not them overrunning the the. Um, Kernza, but the Kernza seems to have crowded that out because the lamb's quarter and the pigweed will get five, six feet tall if, if nothing else crowds it out. So from that standpoint, it's looking good. It's been a dry spring. We really haven't had rain for a month. It was supposed to rain a half inch later tonight. So we'll see. Apparently once the head starts to droop, that's when you want to come out and swath it.